Maddie Glab sitting down with one of our offensive line linemen, Ike Bucker. And Ike, we're going to count down to camp here. So as we do so, a couple questions for you to learn a little bit more about who Ike Bucker truly is. First for you, you've spent most of last season rehabbing back from an injury, re-signed here in the off season. We are fully healthy, we're ready to go. Scale of one to 100, how excited are you to get back on the field this season and be healthy with your boys? Yeah, it's just fantastic to feel good and be able to run around. Um, you know, OTA's time, nice time to just come together as a team and then gearing up for camp. Just having a healthy off season is huge and you know, last year totally off my body feels great, so I'm fresh and, and feeling good. Oh, we're so excited to see you back out there. You know, you've become, I feel like, a favorite amongst your teammates anytime your name gets brought up. I mean, Josh Allen goes to crazy lengths to talk about you anytime your name is brought up. Best guy in the room, can't say a bad thing about him. And I feel like it's the same anytime you talk to somebody else on the team about you. How did you become a favorite? I'm just a positive energy guy, <laughs> um, don't have very many bad days, and just to come work at a place like this with the guys that are around, it's hard to, to have a bad day, and then I have you know, a great wife and, and kids at home and a great family and support system, so I'm just blessed to be here. and. I try to show that you know every day and how I live. Speaking of your family, you have two kiddos at home. What's the best part about being a dad? Just leaving here and hanging out with them. Uh, going to play outside and they're getting a little older. My boy just turned three, so hanging out with him and my daughter's gonna be two at, at the end of June. So, you know, just spending time with them is fantastic. And with the weather turning in Buffalo, it's time to get out in the yard and throw the football around and wrestle whatever he wants to do. Any fun plans for you in June or July? You guys truly get to rest and relax before training camp begins. Are you going anywhere with the family? Are you gonna spend it in Buffalo? What are you gonna be up to? Um, we have a house back in Iowa, so a couple of my friends are getting married. Uh, my dad's doing a couple of the weddings, actually, and I'm in a couple of them, so weddings, just hanging out, you know, catching up with family. We don't have any, any trips or anything planned, but it's nice to just kind of relax a little bit before we come back out here for, for training camp. I hear you're a coffee connoisseur. Yeah, I like what's, coffee. What's your favorite cup of coffee to drink? Do you have a specialty drink that you like and where did this love start? So growing up, my mom owns and operates a coffee shop, a gift shop, Shout antique shop, Barn Happy, it's called, oh. um, in Iowa, Cedar <laughs> Falls, Iowa, 20, her 22nd year this year. My and gosh. I grew up, my first job was making scotcheroos for the barn. What's the washing scotcheroo? It's like a rice crispy, peanut butter rice crispy with chocolate on I, top. You have to bring those for the whole team now. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, my mom makes a drink called the Barn Bomber. And it's like Irish cream, caramel, a little cream, like fresh cream mm -hmm. and then cold brew. And that's my go-to. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Do you try and recreate it here? I try to just keep it for special occasions. Okay. You know, I'm trying to keep my body comp down a little bit. We see you. We <laughs> see you. That's amazing. Yeah. And you worked there when you were a kid? Yeah, washing dishes and trying to keep the ladies in line there. Aren't we all trying to keep the ladies in line? <laughs> <laughs> Ike, thanks so much for answering those questions. Barn happy. Go visit it in Iowa. Yes, thank you. I love it.